Hello everyone, this is Sandy. Today we're gonna make a soup which is a pigeon consomme with foie gras and grilled figs. You should receive a box like this so with all the ingredients that you need and an instruction card which you can refer to later. So let's see what we have. This is a soup dish but it is very very elegant. This is pigeon consomme that we've made at the restaurant for you. The consomme is uh, made with basically pigeon uh, we roast the pigeon and we cooked it with a lot of aromatics uh, together in uh, like you wouldn't make regular stock. But after you make the stock, you need to actually clarify that because consummate needs to be crystal clear. And so then after you make the stock, then you need to actually go through a process where you chop a lot of the vegetables, egg white. It takes it another hour or two to actually make it clear. It's all pre-made for you. And this is uh, foie gras, so it's goose liver fresh goose liver that we've actually sous vide for you already. Again, you just need to actually warm it up. And uh, Turkish figs, which we have grilled it for you as well. So let's put this dish together. Okay, so the first step in putting this soup dish, very elegant soup dish together, is to get some boiled water, get a bowl, put the water in there, and then you add about half of that amount of uh, just I guess room temperature water so that you can put your finger in here without boiling yourself. And you take the foie gras and you put it in here. It's vacuum packed. So it will help to warm up the foie gras while you heat up the soup. So put that into the saucepan. Turn up the heat. And in the meantime, you can get a bowl. You can use a soup bowl. You can be creative. Use any bowl that you like. Basically take the fake. We're gonna put the foie gras here later. Okay, so this is completely boiled through now. So this is basically ready. And you take the foie gras, take it out of the bag. The foie gras has been sous vide with brandy uh, and salt and pepper and sugar and herbs. And then there's two ways to do this. You can pour the soup directly on here, or if you have one of these things, it would be very elegant. If you're doing a dinner party, pour all the servings of the soup in something like that. Usually you see that in fancy restaurants. And then you bring this out in front of your guests, and then you pour it at the table. Mm -hmm. 